Oh my gosh, I've got the woman who is married to Superman joining me right now. She is from Perryville, Missouri, and they're going to be teaming with superheroes like her husband this weekend. All going to be at the, uh, what's it called, the, the Perry Center? Perry Park Perry Center. Perry Park Center. This is uh, Jessica Johnson, and she is joining me to talk about the second annual Heroes for Kids Comic Con. We are definitely happy to be able to have it this year. That is fantastic. Tell us a little history behind your organization. Heroes for Kids, we started back in 2015 as, honestly, an idea from our kids from going down to Metropolis. Mm -hmm. They thought it would be cool if Home Dad... Home of Superman, by the Home way. Home of Superman. They thought it would be cool if Dad would dress up as Superman and walk around Metropolis. Did Dad fly him down there, or did you drive? No, they prefer that we don't fly. Yeah. They don't want him to use his powers, so... Hmm. Superman's going to be joined by all kinds of kids uh, dressing up, and, and that's encouraged. Yes, absolutely. Come in, cosplay, have fun with it. You're going to have some big names there, too. Uh, we have John Anderson from Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 coming in. Cool. He played uh, Shran, one of Zand Yandu's Ravengers. We have uh, Philo Barnhart, who is a second-generation Disney animator. He He's the co-creator of The Little Mermaid, worked on Beauty and the Beast. Heard of it. A few of them. Yeah. And then we have Matthew Ashley, who is an actor and artist coming in. He's played in Ozark, Nashville, The Gifted. We have uh, New York Times and USA Today best-selling author Richard Knack, who is the author of the Dragonlance series. He has written um, World of Warcraft Wolfheart uh -huh. and has done a lot of, well, he has 60 novels, roughly. Yeah, the list goes on and on and on. You're going to have an auction, and everybody who <laughs> goes, who buys a ticket, in a way, they're kind of like a superhero because Absolutely. the proceeds are helping out. Yes. Some, um, some important organizations. The proceeds from our show, all of our booth sales, our silent auction proceeds, monetary donations, any sponsorship money that's left is being split between the Missouri National Veterans Memorial and St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. So how big of a space is this and how many people do you expect? Um, we have 80 vendors wow. set up and we're going to have... Our first year for a one-day show, we had a little over 500 people. We are being advertised much more widely this year, so we are hoping to double, if not even triple, that number. Yeah, Perryville not that far away either, from St. Louis. If 75 you, if you miles south. That's it. And so it all begins at what time? 10 a.m. is our general admission, and it goes from 10 to 6. And how much are tickets? $5. $5? $5. You're basically letting people in for free. We want people to be able to bring the family and come in and still be able to support our vendors that are there. Yeah. Unfortunately, a lot of shows have much higher ticket prices and we wanted to keep it affordable for families. Yeah. Well, we're going to go to Randy Naughton right now. This is Jessica Johnson. Randy's kind of a superhero. Awesome. 